Hello everyone, this is Mark Peek at Keller Williams Real Estate, your short sale specialist for the Roseville and Sacramento area. And I want to talk about a recent success uh, that we had. Um, we had a, a file that was a, uh, it was serviced by Wells Fargo, and the investor is Fannie Mae. Um, it's an investor owned property, um, and it's upside down probably about $200,000 in negative equity. Well, interesting thing, we submitted an offer. The offer happens to be an investor. And banks are always very cautious when they see an offer from an investor, whether it's a partnership, an LLC, some type of a corporation. They, they are automatically thinking that somebody is, might, or might be taking advantage of them in some way. So they I'll just say they look at the file a lot closer when they see that buyer there. And as a result, this particular buyer was a partnership. Um, you know, I assume that they're probably buying the property to rent it out. Um, it's a, the offers of market value. Uh, there is no reason why they wouldn't we would suspect that there's any kind of uh, you know shady business going on. Uh, market value is at the same price as the offer. So uh, in this case, they see the partnership. They see uh, the the documents of the partnership, and they automatically flag this file. And I was informed that the file had been closed because it did not meet the investor guidelines. So what did that mean? Well, when I called and got inf more information, the investor guidelines said, oh, the buyer is flipping the property, so the investor doesn't want to work with them. Well, that was not the case here because the buyer can't flip the property if he's buying it for market value. Um, so that's, that's where it's really important to know what is the real issue and know who to contact when you come into a situation like this. So they're telling me that I would have to resubmit the entire file and start over. Well, being a short sale specialist, I know better than that. I don't have to do that. I can contact people and make sure that they realize, so, so let's just say I can go right to the vice president level if I really have to, or a special team that has, uh, has access to really overlook what a negotiator did if they made a mistake. I know that for a fact they made a mistake in this case, and so I call them on it. And as a result, I'm getting my file reopened without having to start over. And that makes a huge difference because starting over from scratch, that's that could take you know uh, another month or, or two and add it to the negotiation time. So again, it's really important to work with uh, somebody who's experienced in short sales completed several like myself and uh, if you have any questions on your specific situation what I can do to help you out please feel free to call anytime and also hit start here at the top of the page and I'll be happy to follow up with you thank you very much have a great day